going to see the boys doing some Irish dancing, ladies and gentlemen. All right, we're going to have a bit of crack with you now. We're going to do a, a hurley dance. So we're going to use these stuck sticks here, which are called the hurley sticks. In Scotland, they call them shinty. Similar kind of game. And uh, I'm not to be confused with the other kind of hurling, which is what happens on a Saturday night when you have too many points of Guinness and a bad kebab. Totally different. So here's the boys. It's an old style dance called uh, Shadows Dancing. Are you ready, boys? He's 16 years of age. Uh, then we got Finn here. He's just turned 15 on the banjo. We got Dempsey is 11. Uh, I'm the daddy. I'm 21. <laughs> just like all of you. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we've got a new CD out. We've been working on during the whole COVID thing, and uh, it's uh, been out a couple of weeks now. And uh, we've been looking to have uh, been, uh, received two awards so far for it. We got uh, the best up and coming stars and uh, for the boys and uh, best CD cover for a Celtic band that's playing in America, which is really, really cool, so... What did I do with that? The war's next Monday. Um, we're going to play check off the CD. So, to crack is, we arrived over here three years ago from Ireland, from Donegal, and uh, with the help of uh, playing in Raglan Road. And uh, you, you all know Raglan Road, in Disney Springs? Good stuff. We play there for brunch every Saturday and Sunday from 12 to 3.45. And um, so uh, then we came over and we played in Ragnar for six months. Then we went on tour. We bought a little RV. It was 21 feet long. VW RV. We cost us $7,000. We're going to tour all around America in this $7,000 RV. What could go wrong? <laughs> so we took off. Delighted with ourselves. Packed it to the rafters. We took off and we did loads of states up towards uh, Ohio and Cleveland and New York and back down to Florida again. And then we it was still going great, so we took off and went west and we did uh, Las Vegas, Colorado, and um, over to California. Went from Colorado, from uh, California, LA, we drove up to New York in three days. I'm not doing that again. And then back down to Florida. We did uh, 33 states, we did 13,000 miles, and we got back to Florida and we sold the RV for $8,500. God bless America! Woo! Brilliant. Love it. So we're on our travels. We were on through Texas and um, we, uh, we came across, um, we got, ran into a bit of a tornado. We knew nothing about tornadoes, so it was coming at us. Can do it? Okay, so this noise came on the phones. 
Oh, it's, hang on. His alarm is out of tune. So we're driving down the road and we heard this noise. Yes, that one. So we heard the message says, there's a tornado heading straight for us across the field. So we're trying to get out of the way of this thing. So um, we put the foot down and we got out of the way. This thing just went. We missed it by a couple of miles, we went straight across the highway. And uh, but uh, we slowed down halfway through this because the wind was so strong. And then we picked up speed and we took off. And the boys wrote some music, put some music together about this ordeal with the tornado. And it's on our CD and it's called The Texas Tornado. So it starts off on a Tuesday afternoon. We're driving down the road between Houston and Dallas. Thanks so much, everybody. Logan, why are you so close?